good lightweight clash between Justin Gaethje and Conor McGregor. So here is Conor McGregor making the walk once again, the only simultaneous two-division champion in UFC history, and really a guy who has taken the sport by storm. His win over Jose Aldo, Nate Diaz, most recently Eddie Alvarez. Remarkable what McGregor has accomplished in a short time in the UFC. Conor McGregor has that it factor, along with a fantastic and creative striking game, a very good ground game, and extreme confidence in himself. All these make for a fan-favorite combination. So an interesting stylistic clash in front of this young fighter here tonight. You got to think he's trying to figure out how best to get this fight to the ground and use his ability to pass. This guy cuts the guard with the best of them. Great technique, but also a plus athlete. And he's not afraid to lean on that athleticism and do some unorthodox things to better position himself on the ground. This guy has tremendous ground technique, and his ability to pass guard and get to a dominant position is elite. And now our tale of the tape for this lightweight fight. Both fighters 29 years of age. McGregor will have a three-inch reach advantage. All right, now for the official introductions, we go inside the octagon where we find Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge, Eve Loving. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the MGM Grand Garden Arena in Las Vegas. It's time! Five rounds in the UFC lightweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a kickboxer. Only a professional record now. 21 wins, four losses. He stands five feet nine inches tall, weighing in at 155 pounds. Fighting out of Dublin, Ireland, the notorious Connor McGregor! And now to defeat his opponent. This man is a kickboxer, only a professional record of 19 wins, two losses. He stands 5 feet 11 inches tall, weighing in at 155 pounds. Justin, the highlight, Gaethje! Okay, protect yourself at all time, obey my command at all time. If you want to touch love, do it now, go back All to right, the here we go. I am fired up for this fight. It's been a long time coming, and they're finally going to get after it. You ready? You ready? All right, ready for live action here at the MGM Grand Garden Arena here in the fight capital of the world. So here he is, the man. Oh, oh huge right hand! What a wild exchange! Nice liver shot, Lawrence. He is in big trouble here. He's wincing in pain. And now starting to snap off that jab. Man, Joe, he continues to leave that head open. That one here to stun him. 
He's in trouble right now. Nice leg kick. Oh, he might be out. Shot is blocked. He's down. Oh, another damaging head kick lands Joe, and defensively, the opponent's got to start thinking about blocking some of these. I know he prides himself on his toughness and his chin, but the next one could knock him down and potentially out of this fight. There's the jab, then another. Under two minutes now to go in round one. Jab by Gaethje. Punch is blocked. Conor McGregor gets hit by that leg kick. You may want to start checking some of these. That one hurt. Oh, tags him with that uppercut, Joe. Conor McGregor with a vicious leg kick. Yeah, oh. looks a little wobbly on his feet. This could be it. Throwing that jab, no good. Well, he's always on the counterattack, but a nice leg kick there by McGregor. There's the kick again. Oh, clipped him with the jab. Gaethje's leg appears to be hurt here, Joe. You can visibly see him starting to limp. He lands it to the leg. That punch is true. Horn sounds for the end of round one. Big power on this punch and results in a knockdown. Here's a perfectly placed kick that results in a knockdown. And here's a huge, perfectly placed punch that lands with devastating impact. Incredible highlights in that round. Brittany Palmer in the building as usual. If they continue it this way in this round, someone's gonna get knocked out. Lands a kick to the leg here, Joe. He's down! Well, you know these leg kicks, Joe, are a big part of this arsenal. Oh, man. He got nailed in the body. He is in big trouble here. Nice combination. Oh, he's going for it here. There's a nice inside leg kick. Oh, head kick! How clean is that jab by Gaethje? Very nice leg kick for him there. Can't take too many of those. Look at that nasty jab. McGregor's eye looks so swollen now, Joe, that I would at least ask the question. Is the oh! He's got him here. Big shots! Back to his feet again. Here, and as a result, he has taken control of this second round. 
Landing a good series of strikes here. Big oh. kick to the head. He's hurt. He's stunned. Yeah, Joe, the finish comes courtesy of some outstanding ground and pound, and it's one thing to try to score when you have your opponent in a compromised position on the ground. It's another thing to try to end the fight, and that's exactly what he was trying to do here tonight. Elbows and punches and hammer fists, one weapon after the next, and ultimately the knockout materializes. Nicely done there. Take a look at this from a different angle. Boom! And he's out. So a strong candidate for some bonus money there. A huge knockout for him here tonight. Near perfect execution. They'll be talking about this result for some time. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Eve Levine has called a stop to this contest. At three minutes, 14 seconds of round number two. Declaring the winner by knockout, Justin the Highlight Game Chief. So just the way he drew it up here tonight, what a monumental moment and knockout to get his hand raised here tonight. He kept the judges out of it. He has certainly set himself up for a major opportunity here moving forward, but you can be sure tonight is about this knockout. He'll be celebrating deep into the night with his friends, his family, his coaches.